Okay, so let's have a look at entry approval in Gravity View. So as I mentioned earlier, there's this option here, show only approved entries. If you check that, um, there's another option that appears, show all entries to administrators. So if you check that, it means that admins regardless will see all entries regardless of the approval status. Okay, so if you enable entry approval, it means that you'll need to approve entries before they show up in your directory. And there are a couple of different ways to do that in Gravity View. So you can either do it manually uh, by going to this uh, entries page and actually uh, clicking approve, or you can do it automatically. So I'll show you both ways. So the first way is the manual way, and you can do that by heading over to the entries page in Gravity Forms. As you can see, these are all of our form entries for our business directory. Now to approve an entry, all you need to do is hover over this uh, circle here on the left and this uh, just check this um, or click on this uh, green check mark. So as you can see, that entry has been approved now and now that will show up in our directory. Of course, if you want to disapprove it, you can just click on this red cross here. Okay, so that's the manual way. So how do you... Uh, approve entries automatically. Well, the first thing you need to do is edit your um, directory listing form. So here we are in the Gravity Forms uh, form editor. And if we come over here to the right side under add fields, scroll down, you'll see the Gravity View tab here. If you open that, you'll see that Gravity View adds a couple of fields here. The one we want is the approve slash reject field. So we'll just drag and drop that into our form. And as you can see, it's an admin only field, meaning that only administrators will be able to see this field. Uh, users won't be able to. So how this works is that there's a little checkbox here that says approved. When a user submits an entry, you can go in, edit the entry, and then manually check approved, save the entry again, and that entry, the approval status will change to approved and it will display in the directory. Alternatively, you can automatically approve entries. And the way to do that is by just clicking on the field um, to open the field settings, and you just scroll down here. And as you can see next to approved, there's a little check mark icon. If you just click on that, you can see it goes green. And if we go back to the field, you can see here, now it's actually checked by default. So that means when a user creates an entry, by default, the approval status will be set to approved. That means it will automatically show up in our directory. Of course, you can always go back and edit the entry and then unapprove it again, if you wish to do so.